Hey guys, Krista Jones here from Davy and Krista, where we help businesses build brands that book. In today's video, we're going to be talking through a new fun tool that Show It just released, the Line Tool. But before we dive in, make sure that you hit like on this video and subscribe to the channel for updates on future Show It tools. So up until now, if you wanted to add a line to Show It, you actually had to kind of fake it. You had to make a rectangular box and then make it one pixel tall. And not only did you have to format it on both desktop, you also had to head over and do it on mobile. Mobile. Otherwise, you might check out your mobile version and have a big rectangular box on your mobile version. But Show It just rolled out with a brand new tool to make adding lines to your website really, really easy. So let's dive in. If we wanted to add a line to our website, from now on, all you need to do is come down to the settings area down here and then click line. Show It's gonna drop in this line on your website. And if you come over on the right side to line style, you can change some of the formatting. So you can change the thickness, or thinness. If we wanted it to be one pixel tall again, we can make it one pixel tall. You can change the end caps. We can make them square by leaving it as none, or you can make them rounded by selecting rounded. You can change the color. You can change the opacity. You can change whether it's solid or a dashed line or a dotted line. And then if we wanted to make a line expand the full width of the page, we can extend it so that it goes to either side. And then if you come down to size and position and select this last, horizontal locking line it'll expand to the whole width of the page so let me show you down here and now you can see that it ends on the ends of the page regardless of how big your screen is and it's about as simple as that. If you already added lines the old way to your website, or you have a template that has lines that are added the old way, I don't necessarily think it's worth going back onto your site and replacing all of the old lines with this new line. They're still gonna look the same. They're still gonna function the same. I would probably just use this new line tool going forward. If you're adding a section to your site or you're adding a new designed area to your site and you need a line tool, this is gonna make adding lines a lot easier. If you have questions or comments, make sure that you drop them below and hit like and subscribe to this channel to get updates about future videos that we release. Thanks guys.